Good morning, Thomas Moore. We got some good news today regarding our football Thursday action against the mighty BR Celtics. Okay, uh, we anticipated most of the grade 12s purchasing uh, uh, the majority of the tickets this week. However, we have some good news that we do have some tickets available for our grade 9 to 11 students to purchase. Okay. Um, the grade 9 to 11 students' parents have received an email detailing how exactly to purchase those tickets, which Ms. Whalen will be describing shortly on the procedures on how to go about receiving or wristbands and so on to get admittance into the game. We're looking forward to a good game. I know I was kicking a can up on the East Mountain the other day and I walked by my local Big Bear and I saw some BR students talking a lot of smack, saying that the Green Machine's coming into town to show us uh, how they do things up there. So. I know that our coaches and our players are going to be really eager to show them how it's done up on the, on the West Mountain. The number one team in Canada is going to put on a good show today. So the good news is we have tickets and hopefully we can get as many students out there, especially the 9s and 11s out there to watch this great game. I mean the weather's beautiful, I don't know what more you'd want to do. It's a Thursday afternoon, watch your team play. So we have Ms. Whalen's going to describe the good news and how we're going to get those tickets. Good luck. STM. I'm Miss Whalen. You will recognize me from this year's game day hits as no I cannot get you into the game and please get away from the field. <laughs> I'm so happy today to be able to change my tune and welcome you to our home field to see STM in playoff action. Um, as Mr. Juba said, tickets are now available or starting at 930 for purchase for those in grades 9 to 11, grade 12s, you had your chance to get your tickets yesterday. On your lunches, only on your grade level lunches, you will come to the lecture hall if you have previously purchased a ticket to receive a wristband. Um, for grade 11 and nines, we will start 15 minutes into the lunch period. At 11.15, you'll meet me there and I will put the wristband on you and it'll give you easy access into the game with um, no great lineup or congestion. A couple of things, the wristbands are non-transferable. I'm gonna put them on myself. So you can't take them off, but you cannot switch or trade off with a friend. Um, and also there are no in-out privileges at the game. There is a washroom available on the facilities and um, you can um, come in, but dress warmly. Once you're in the game and once you've been admitted, if you leave, you are leaving for the remainder of the game. So please bring all your warm attire with you um, to watch the game, okay? I'll see you in the lecture hall on your lunches, grade nines through 12s for ticket purchasers only. Only if you have previously purchased a ticket through cash online, and then I'll see you at the game. Okay, thanks guys. Good morning, STM. My name is Layla, and I'm here for your announcements. Football swag has arrived. We'll be distributing items starting by grade. Any staff in grade 12s who have placed an order can come to room 150 in the new wing between 9.30 and 10.15 today. All staff and grade 11s can pick up their items between 12.15 and 12.45. Tomorrow or after school until 3. All grades can pick up items after school tomorrow and on Monday. Again, pickup is in room 150A in the new wing. And we're only distributing to grade 12s today. There is a volunteer opportunity for students that need Christian service hours at Garth Trails Community Center. They require five to ten students per week, per week working with residents. Wednesdays and Fridays evenings, 5.30 to 7.30. You'll be teaching residents how to use cell phones, tablets, laptops, email, social media, etc. Need to be tech savvy. Attention girls hockey players. The STM hockey team will be returning to the ice this winter. If you are interested in trying out for this year's team, please attend a meeting today right after school in room 241, the health room. Tryouts are open to girls in grade 9 to 12 plus. This message is for students with IEP. Please check your email for important final exam information. If you have any questions, please come by to room 217 to speak with a sir. If you're writing your exam for the resource, please come by 217 on the day of your exam at 8 a.m. with your textbook. Pitcher retake day is today. All students who are absent on our, our pitcher day in September are eligible for their photo to be taken today. In, attention, in addition, those students who were not happy with their first pitcher package may bring their proofs to the photographer when called to have a retake. We will call students down by the, by the cafeteria by their last name. Please do not come down until you're called. 
And now for your sports. Last night in junior girls basketball action, your Lady Knights took on the Cardinals from St. John Henry Newman in a semi-final game. The game saw back and forth action with your Lady Knights pulling away in the second half, stealing the victory by a final score of 52 to 40 and punching their ticket to the gold medal win. Gold medal game. Izzy Morrow led the Knights with 23 points and Milena Bozzo chipped in with 11 points. Great job, ladies. Thank you, STM. Good morning, STM. My name is Alice and I'm the grade 11 rep here from your student council. And here are your announcements. Just a reminder that we are still selling our vintage jerseys and our spirit wear. You can pick it up during the first 15 minutes of your lunch period on Tuesdays and Thursdays. STM, as we are in November, let's remember the souls of the faithfully departed, the souls of those fighting who fought for us in battle, and those fighting a different battle, a battle with cancer. During November, people show their support and cancer awareness by growing a mustache. Your student council will be hosting a competition to see who can grow the best stash. We encourage all of you to participate. Students, staff, even get your dog to participate. We encourage it. Please DM us or email us your before pictures so we can follow up with you at the end of the month to decide the winner for this glorious competition. And finally, for the exciting news, STM, we have determined a winner for our candy jar guessing game. Drum roll, please. Congratulations to Abraham Julian. You can pick up your prize at the student council office during the first 15 minutes of your break. Please bring some form of ID so that we can confirm it's you and give you your prize. And lastly, don't forget to follow us on Instagram at STM underscore council and on Twitter at STM Nights. Thanks STM and have a terrific Thursday. STM, those are all of your announcements. The time is now 821. Have a great day.